Psychology applies to every aspect of our lives, um, I guess to the, the basic decisions we make when we get up in the morning, to you know the, the things that we love, to how we um, engage with our friends, it, it, it's massive. Cerebra Centre, um, I think, is really unique in that it's one of the only centres in the country that's specifically dedicated to looking at behaviour and behaviour difficulties in children with rare genetic syndromes and neurodevelopmental disorders. So we're able, as a team, to think about, OK, why are these behavioural difficulties occurring and what can we do to try and help by either reducing the behaviour or by preventing it occurring in the first place. Uncertainty and not understanding something can be one of the most stressful things that people have to experience. So being able to provide some answers to families, even if it's just small bits of information, they're, they're like nuggets of gold for families, I think. And it, it actually explains something that they've been wrestling with for a number of years. I think it has impact on multiple levels. Families feel heard, they feel listened to, they feel that their concerns are being taken seriously by, by somebody. On a more specific level, having a, a full assessment um, of behaviour and being able to then take that report to a professional and be able to get some input would have a huge impact on people's life and it can be quite empowering to have that information. Um, and then research-wise, I think, because research can take a long time, so for those families I think they are just happy to know that we are, we are moving things forward and that we are progressing research into that particular genetic syndrome in a, a way that will help people for the future. I think over time, when you get to know the families and when you get to see what people are experiencing and you get to know the children and you get to see their strengths and we talk a lot about difficulties in the centre because that's what we're ultimately trying to solve but, but people are, uh, are astounding and then you become quite invested in, in that because you, you feel that actually you, you, you've got that connection with the people that you're working with which is a real luxury I think in research because often you're tucked away in a lab and you don't actually get to see where, where is this going to be useful. I, I get to see it every day which is what I love about coming into work and why I will continue to come into work.